Construction of a 75 degree angle without using a protractor is an important geometry assignment in high school mathematics. In this animation video, we are going to watch all the steps of drawing a 75 degree angle. I suggest you to subscribe this 3D educational channel before your YouTube account lost this channel. This is the only channel in YouTube where every construction is available in 3D. So, let's start building the angle by drawing a straight line on the middle of the sheet. The straight line segment is named OA. We need to use a pencil compass. A circle segment of any radius is drawn by taking the point O as the center. This length of radius will be kept constant throughout the process. The circle arc crosses the line OA at the point U. Then another circle arc of the same radius is drawn. This time point U is taken as the center. It intersects the previous circle arc at the point V. After this another circle segment of equal radius is drawn, centering the point V. This time a bigger arc has been drawn. Suppose this circle arc intersects the first one at the point W. Again placing the tip of the compass on W, another circle arc is drawn to get an intersection against the third arc. The point of intersection is X. Next align the scale along O and X and take an intersection against the first circle arc. This point of contact is Y. Now if we connect point O and point V, then a 60 degree angle will be created. And if we join O and Y, it will produce a 90 degree angle. Thus the angle of 75 degree lies between O, Y and O, V. If we bisect the angle V, O, Y, which is a 30 degree, we should get a 15 degree angle. 60 and 15 make 75. So, we are now going to bisect the angle V, O, Y. Now, we shall divide the angle V, O, Y into two equal parts. Two circle arcs of the same radius are drawn from point V and point Y. These two arcs meet each other at point Z. Finally, with the help of a scale and a pencil, point Z and point O are joined. So, we got the required angle. Its name is angle AOB. To be sure, we need to verify the practical value of the angle. The value can be verified by using a protractor. Regular practice and better combination of compass and other drawing instruments can take you to accuracy. If you like the video, click like and subscribe this channel to get other videos from this channel. Thank you for watching the video.